Hey everybody, it's your favorite YouTuber Anthony Chabot. I'm back with Tale from the Herd Episode 3 Midtown Comics. Now, uh, here's a story of my relationship with Midtown Comics. Now, Midtown Comics was formed in 1997 by Jerry and Tom. I don't, Jerry, I forgot what his name was. So they formed, you know, I heard of it. I, my mom used to shop for them. You know, here's a story. Uh, what? Ever since uh, Ahmed Time Out for Comics ran out of business, I started going to World Club most frequently. Since I was fired from Regal, unfortunately, because of new management, we'll get to that in a future episode. I started going to Midtown Comics when I started going to see Dr. Jam Jam Jamil Kabeski, who is known as Jamal. You know, I went there every week. They were kind and everything. I was, it had been going on for three years, you know. I went there and everything, you know, started collecting books, going to signings, and I was warned. And I was warned of my behavior back then, you know. I went there for three years, uh, and I was on their, their show, Comic Book Heroes. Unfortunately, that didn't get picked up. So... It was going on, and I went to go see Annette. I went to pick up my comics after I went to go see Annette. They were kind to me, and I was friends with Ted Alexander, who's now living in Florida right now. He had me blocked, but that's the story. I'll get to that in a little while. Then I went over there for a special event. One time, one weekend, I went, and then we had the Book of the Month Club, you know, where I met artists and everything. So one time in July 2013, I was going through mental health problems and everything. Uh, this, and by the way, they will be addressing my book. Unfortunately, thinking. Uh, unfortunately, I was I really wanted to go to New York Comic Con. Unfortunately, I was going through that. I didn't win it. I flipped out. I threw things like Brock Lesnar, you know. Then a few days later. Uh, after I went to Annette, I went there. Ted told me, may I have a word with you? He said that you are banned from going to Midtown Comics. It's been going, it was going on and on like a cycle and everything. Try to come back, try to come back. We, he made a deal saying in 2020, you'll come back. That was at the time, uh, where I wasn't in a good mood. You know, 2015, I was with my second worker, Desmond, which I'll get into in a future episode. Unfortunately, Ted Ted said, no, you're not allowed back. And unfortunately, Ted Alexander, he had power. He had the power to do that because he was the manager of Midtown Comics. Then it went by, went by. I tried calling him one time. He wasn't there. He took his day off. But unfortunately, I called him. You know, Ted was furious. He said the next time... Uh, the next time I bartered him, he was going to have me arrested. Then two years later, he left, he left and I'm still waiting to get back in. Unfortunately, Dor has moved to California. Zoe has moved on and I was good friends with a lot of people from Midtown Comics. Then Zoe, uh, left, she left on bad terms. She can't get into specifics why. But I love going to Midtown Comics, you know. I was going through a mental health. I just want to say to the owners of Midtown Comics watching this, I am very sorry. And I'm hoping that you guys meet when my book comes out. And after the pandemic, we can meet, we can talk about me coming back. You know, I know you got new staff right now, but I'm, I'm very sorry. You know, I was going through mental health problems, you know, and... Unfortunately, I they kicked me out of Midtown Comics. I'm hoping I come back. And that's the end of Tale from 3, Episode 3, Midtown Comics. Now, Episode 4 will be about my good friend Elaine Floodgate. That's going to be out maybe in a couple of weeks. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, AntiChabot, Twitter.com, 450, Instagram, Show 20 Facebook.com, AntiChabot, sharing, caring, share it. With your friend, your family, you know, click on the notification when I come on. So far, we got 262 subscribers left. Push for 270. 
Uh, and by the way, I, I apologize, Midtown Comics, because of my behavior. I was going through rough. And I'm especially, I'm sorry, Ted Alexander, even though you have me blocked on on your social media account. And I'm very sorry, Doug Parker, for doing this. I'm hoping I come back. And I'm very sorry, Jerry and Tom. And, and by the way, before I let you go, I forgot. And then a few days later, uh, Tom called me on the phone. He said, uh, we got to... Ted is very protective of his door, and he told me, oh, you can't come back while he's around. We have to follow the mayor, the de Blasio's orders, and he said candidly that you can come back. And then after that, Ted is now living in Florida. He wants to be left alone. So I apologize. Until next time, Anthony out. <laughs>